I'm still under the assumption that if we do the dun the last two dungeons before Turtle Rock, we can get what's it called the Gold Sword and go stupid. Ice Palace is level five. Okay. Hmm. I wanted to get a heart piece, but apparently I can't. Oh well. Let's get some good armor at least. Hmm. Need to burn them. Slight problem. Okay, that works. I don't need the fire rod. Oh, the lamp works. That'll actually be much more co much more cost efficient. God, if we keep this up, we're just gonna beat the fucking game today. <laughs> Those wall guys are in Link to the Past. Hey, there we go. Death to all penguins. Fuck all trying. I mean, you're gonna give me the option. I'm gonna fucking use it. I think the lamp lips. We'll try it out in a minute. Yeah, I didn't think Bombos would work either, honestly. That was a very pleasant surprise. Because I was going to be really mad if I have to do Dungeon 4 again. I'm saving that for last because I can never remember Dungeon 4. God damn, it's the worst. That is the true Lost Woods. Help? Boy, good thing using Bombos isn't an investment. Yeah, I could just spam the hell out of it. Uh. Are those Kappas? No, they're penguins. Wait. Uh oh. <laughs> okay, this is where I want to go. Also, I think we start fighting Stealthos here. Damn it! Just imagine Link swinging ineffectually at the tiniest fucking thing ever. I think I need a bomb here. Yep, here comes the Stalfos. Gotta kill him with bombs. Which was a neat little callback in, uh, b -b -b uh words. Skyward Sword. Skyward Sword? Yeah, you could use bombs on Stalfos to beat them much easier. Oh, yeah. I didn't think they were needed to actually kill them in Twilight Princess. Were they? Hmm. Stealth was in Twilight Princess. I don't think so. Every Zelda game is basically a callback to the past Zelda game, so it wouldn't surprise me if it was the case. Yeah. I'm gonna press that button again. No, I'm not. Okay, good. It's fine. Give me hearts. Arrows don't count. I, uh, saw f someone... I saw a friend of mine stream Swordcraft and Sorcery, and I did not like that. 
It just didn't seem like my kind of game, you know? Also, those pe penguins apparently seem to be guaranteed to give you magic, so fuck all. They die by magic. Much like how I die by Spike. I think this is a non-path. We're gonna go down this and realize it's a... It's just showing you another thing if I ever get fucking down there. Okay, let's try Fenful's experiment. One day I won't get interrupted on str Wow! That interruption killed me! Torches do not work, you need to... Bombos them. How much damage does those guys do? I think four, because they melted me in two hits. Okay. Euphoria thrown butt on eyes is wonderful. They're, That's an impressively confusing sentence. They're talking about Nuclear Throne, which is a twin stick shooter much akin to Binding of Isaac, but with a more uh, apocalyptic theme. Basically, what they're talking about is a power up that gives you, that slows down enemy bullets, and a custom power up is what they're discussing. I thought I'd have to give context to Nuclear Throne, but here we are. Wait. I may have forgotten something. I have to come and rent that thing from another angle, don't I? Well, while we're here... It healed me, didn't it? Oh crap, do I have to kill all the monsters here? Hang on, what am I doing? Why are we trying? Why are we caring? Hashtag effort. There's a button here that I gotta find. Floor has to be the bomb. Oh yeah, that's right. That's what I thought. But that means I have to go back, which is troublesome. There you are, you little bastard. Oh, uh, what? Uh, okay, sweet. I think this boss only responds to the rod or the lantern. Ooh, that will be interesting. Because then I'll feel like a fool. What? Oh, hello. I doubt the torch will work, but if it does, I will be quite pleased. I'd imagine Bombos would work well. What the hell's this room? Ow. Uh, nope. Keep going up and you'll get the big key. Oh yeah, it would've helped if we had the big key for the chest. Telepathy stone, so we could talk to Zelda, of all people. Uh oh, may have made a mistake. Oh, I may have made a mistake. Oh wow, that just straight up kills them. I thought it would turn them into clones. Would it really have been a mistake if you could just do it again and clear them out? Kind of, yeah, because that would mean consuming magic. Uh oh. Smooth as glass. Nice. Hmm. 
tricky, tricky game design developers. Yeah, smooth as ice. Jesus. I believe this is the tongue that you actually need to pull. Also gotta say, those, uh, those little bop things in Link Between Worlds, fucking creepy, dude. The happy ground boys. Yes. Ah, no! Oh, fuck. I'm here again! No, no! <laughs> Just take an eight of your life, asshole! Fuck you and your childhood, eh? Um, this one. Just because I don't like them ground boys. I don't like them. I don't like their face. Bleh. No. No bleh. Thankfully you came from level 6 so we could seek and break the most annoying puzzle in the game. Really? What puzzle is that? It must have something to do with the statue we had to push. Well, there goes any capacity to use magic. Thanks, Auntie Fairy. We get blue. We get blue pajamas, and the ugliest looking hat I've ever seen. Well, if they couldn't get the hair right, they might as well make the hat gold. Hmm. I'm the boss, shit. I feel like something's wrong, but I don't know what. Oh, I see what that's supposed to do. I just take you to more fairies. Whoa. Audio went to hell there for a second. Not again! Oh, was it, was it you had to put the bomb up? You had to kill the dude on the fucking... It was, wasn't it? You had to kill the dude on the switch in order to progress, isn't it? I bet that's the fucking sequence. No. Oh yeah, there's a neat thing you could do with the key in Somali. Shoot people. Huh, that is pretty cool. Uh, that is progress. These are supplies, probably. What? What? Like I turned away like everything. I turned away for a second to look at Chen, then I'm all of a sudden taking hits. What? Again? I think you could pull the right guy's tongue. Yeah, but I think I need a bit of length for that. Oh, that's just the way out. Who needs that though? You know, we have the Titan Fist Gauntlets. Can't we just pick up these statues and huck them? Okay. This is the boss. It's going to be really interesting. I don't know what's going to happen. So that's not working. Will this work? Does look familiar. Maybe he's in a Link Between Worlds. It works! My god! Yeah. I don't fucking believe this. Oh. 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 
Okay, Fuck. maybe it's not the link between worlds. Not that I can remember right now. But I think there's an enemy that starts out shielded. Oh. Frame rate! Please! Oh wow, I killed two of them. Nice. That'll make up for the frame lag we're experiencing here. Yeah. I'm a genius. It'd be great if you killed him and right at the last second, when you have no more hearts left, you get hit by an ice block. <laughs> Fuck you! I can't believe that worked. I was dead set for sure that we would have to go to Dungeon 4 and I would be screaming the entire way. I wonder if Bamos is necessary for some routes in a Link to the Past speedruns. I don't know. Because most speedruns, they have they do tricks and glitches and shit to get away from things. Still need the Fire Rod for Turtle Rock? Yeah. I know. I know. I need a lot of things for Turtle Rock. Basically every fucking thing. Also, I'm debating doing another intermission because I gotta run to the market and get some groceries. Well, now's as good a time as any. Yeah. Is the magic cape a necessary item or optional? You get the magic. You get the magic cape to get the cane of uh, something. Both are entirely optional because they're just, I'm invincible now, I don't take damage. Anyways, 10-15 minute break while I go get groceries.